Hey guys, it's your Glamour Planner, Crafty Girls Rock. I am back with a much anticipated, super, super mega haul video. Do you see this? So I'm going to share all this lovely craftiness with you guys. This is everything that I've collected over a month worth of hauls. Maybe a month and a half worth of hauls. I depend on the last time I've done a haul video showing you guys what I've got. So I don't want to be too long because this is a lot of stuff to share with you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and begin with everything that I have gotten so far. And um, let's begin. Let's jump right on in. So first I'm going to start with everything that I've gotten from Tuesday morning. So everything you see here, 90% of it is from Tuesday morning. There are a few things that I did get from Joann's and I'll share those things. Actually, let's do the Joann stuff first. I'll share the things I got from Joann's, then I'll share what I've got from Tuesday morning, and a few other really, really good things that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. And I posted on Instagram and told you guys how much the Dollar Tree is going to give every craft store a run for their money. But I may have to break the video up because I do have quite a, I have my AliExpress haul that I have <clears throat> in addition to a haul from Joann's and Dollar Tree. So I will, actually I will break this up. So I will share the Joann's and the Dollar Tree things and the AliExpress in the second video. I will start with everything that I got from Tuesday morning. So let's do that. Because Tuesday morning seems like it may be a long video. So I'm going to start with everything from Tuesday morning. So you guys can get an idea of what I got. Alright? Um, since there's so much to be shared. So... Oh, and actually, I actually do have a few things from um, Michael's, but I'm not sure if I have it out to share. But either way, you'll get to see it, okay? So I'm going to start with Tuesday morning. I got these here. I picked these things up here. This is for my jewelry making and my planner accessories making. So I picked these up. I got those two there. I got a couple of stamps. And this one is Birthday Love. I really like this one. It's birthday love. And this one says, I'm pretty sure that with sparkly shoes and a new tiara, she could conquer the world. Isn't that adorable? Yep, got that too. I also got World's Greatest Dad. I got that from Tuesday morning. Things that I have duplicates of, I would definitely, definitely share with you. Um, I got this. I thought this was adorable. I asked if anybody had seen this. And there was only... Um, I believe one or two that came into Tuesday morning over the holiday. So I had picked this up. So that's that one. This is a tag punch board. I love it. I'm constantly, constantly in a tag swap. So I got that. I want to share these because these were on clearance. And then it had a huge sale at Tuesday morning. These are for the meat machine for Heidi Swap. The, none of these are over like a dollar. They were like 39 cent, 49 cent, 50 cent. And a lot of them I did get duplicates of. 79 cent, a dot 99 cent. So these are really, really cheap. Um, and I'm just going to go try and get through them all so you can see. And these are for the mink machine. If you have the mink machine, you know that you can use these. Besides laminating, you can use these. And these are the alphabets. I really, really wanted that. It would be great on some projects. And that's what that one does. I tried to get one of each if it was something I really, really liked. I'm sorry about that. Upside down. If it was something that I really, really wanted, like this is a banner, I would get more than one. These are just some labels. It makes those labels. And this one makes a couple flags. Okay. So I'll be making some flags. And I'm sharing it because I've come up with a new solution for storing things. I craft things while it's winter time and I can't craft in my craft space because it's really, really cold. I actually picked these up. And these are just double-sided tape. And I got four packs of these. These are the quarter inch. I believe, yeah. These are... A quarter inch and maybe half an inch. So I got four of those. And these are some 
sticky thumb dots. And I got a couple of those. A couple packs, two packs of those. Yeah. I just picked up some cards, um, stationary cards. Even though I make my own, Tuesday Morning has such a great variety of stationary cards. And I like to include one whenever people purchase from my store, my on my Facebook store, the Glamour Planner store on Facebook. And I like that whenever I'm doing a swap, I like to send a cute little card if I didn't make it. Normally I make it, but if I don't, it's easy for me to grab a card. And these are adorable. I think this is a peacock that's upside down. And if you see, I actually have the planner and a journal in my shop. That's this peacock, the same peacock. I got my girlfriend um, some of these cards. We like to cut them apart, fussy cut them, and use them in projects. I could definitely see me fussy cutting this and using them in a project. Okay, so that is the stationary cards that I got. And actually two of these I already had, and I just added the rest to my collection because I do like to collect these. Up next are some blending markers that I got from Tuesday morning. So I actually got these purple ones. I got these. Sorry about that. I got these blending markers here. Brown. And this is that aqua teal color set blending markers. I also picked up this punch. This is a flower punch. This is a large topper punch. And you can add a brad to the center. It actually has a center for you to add a brad to it. And I vowed that I'm going to use all those brads that I collect every year from Scrapbook Expo. Okay. So that's that out the way. Next up. Go through these quickly. These bows. One in this color. Let's see. These flowers. I got a couple packs of these. These are by Bull Bunny. Okay. And here's some stickers. I've seen everybody haul. That one. Okay. Two. And he's all Bible Bunny. I love this one. And this one is by Paper House. I love theirs because they make the uh, planner stickers. And I love that. That one for the holiday. I guess I don't use it for some late holiday stuff going out. I'll definitely use it. And look at this one. This one is birthday. That's super cute. That's also by Paper House. Two. These are all by Paper House. Paper House. Bow Bunny. I actually got these clips. I got this by Paper House. And these are the dimensional stickers, as you can see. And then these by My Big Ideas. Super cute. Okay. So, I saw these haul, these Anna Griffin card packs. They come with the die cuts and things so you can make four cards. It's that one. I actually think I actually got two of the same one. That's that. And then I have this one. And it makes these four cards. Okay. Then I got these die cuts. These are holiday die cuts from Bow Bunny as well. That's all the die cuts inside. And that's it. And that's the skew there. I actually got two of those, so I'll show you that one. This is two. And on to 
my washi. I picked up this washi. I really, really love um, the washi that came in. And I actually got them all. I love this freaking washi. I use it in my planner. And now I don't want to change it. I'm using it for the entire month of January. I may even go into February. But just probably some quotes for Black History Month. So... Okay, so I have got a couple packs of that. I'm going to slide that over here. Here is where it gets to be a lot. <laughs> so um, I tried to keep them together. So by vendor. So you um, will see me do them all together by vendor. So uh, these are miscellaneous vendors. This one is by Momenta. is by Momenta as well. And this is by Momenta. I saw this one there sitting for the longest, 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 longest time that I decided I do do a lot of wedding cards. So I got that. And I like this one. Someone had actually returned this. I saw it on the counter and I ended up getting it. This is a gift tag. I'm just super cute. I got that. Here's another tag. I'm obsessed with the tag dies right now. So I did haul a lot of um, tag dies and that's actually very pretty and I saw this I was obsessed with this one I wanted to get it um, especially for my grands making them cards and gifts for their class so Valentine's Day is coming I have to make Valentine um, cards for their class and their teachers so I will make them using that die okay and now going to Crafters Companion. I saw a lot of people hauling these. And I was obsessed with collecting them. These are all by Crafters Companion. And I'm trying to just go fast. I don't want to make the video too long. It guys lose interest. It's a teacup. I really, really wanted that. Some of these were really tiny in the pack. Like this. The butterfly was pretty small. This flower was small. So these will be great on cards and things. I love this one. I saw this one hard and I had to get it. Some of these that I do have duplicates of, I will be doing a giveaway. I have so much to give away. You have no idea. And I just have to get out there and do it. Maybe I'll do an Instagram giveaway. This flowers and then these were all those corner eyes decorative corners yeah the decorative corners now this one was tiny the single corner ones are pretty big gorgeous smaller than what I expected but I do like it I love this and that's a pretty nice size and this mason jar and that was tiny some of these when you turn them around and look at the die they actually are really really tiny that's the fact that I have like a million of these mason jar dies I'm not too mad about I haven't bought some folders so this is a cute one I really like it because of the lid I thought it was so adorable. Okay. That's it for Crafters Companion. And let's go on to Spellbinders. This die. And um, I know y'all seen, um, who was that? Um, one of the crafters on their Facebook page. They had warned us a while back. And make sure when you get your dies from Spellbinders from any store, Joann's mainly, uh, or Tuesday morning, make sure all the dies are in there. And because I had ran into that issue with Joann's, I like when you call them and tell them that the dies are not in there, they will allow you to bring them back. I mean, you have your receipt, you call them up right away. Once you get home, and if you find out that the dies not in there, 
you can take it back and they'll either give you another one if they have it or refund your money if you have the receipt. So that's these dies. As you can see, I went heavy on the dies. I had said this year I was going to focus on dies. I have so many stamps. When I say the for two years, I was just collecting stamps, 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 whether it's prima doll stamps, whatever stamps it was. And then, you know, I got heavy into my Cricut and got, um, now I'm obsessed, was obsessed with my cuddle bug. And now I have the, um, what machine did I get? I end up getting the large die cutting machine, the electronic one, which is the Gemini. I got the full size Gemini. So it's the Gemini that I got. I got the Gemini. So I love it. I'm actually about to pull it out. I've come up with a new storage solution up here. I'm actually crafting upstairs um, in my kitchen area. And I'm trying to keep the stuff off of my kitchen table so that I don't get, you know, <laughs> into trouble with taking over the kitchen table. So I came up with a storage solution for it. And that will do it for my spell binders. So then I had, there were these new dies. Let me share the stencil first. I got this really pretty stencil. This six by six stencil. Um, I thought it was super cute. And um, this is from the Crafters Workshop. And this is by Kathy Cano Mario. I thought that was so freaking adorable. I can't wait. I want to use that on a project. Okay. Even though it's in Spanish, I speak a little bit of Spanish. And I do write and read Spanish. So, I love it. Okay. So, these are... I don't know if you guys ever heard of these dyes. But I know you heard of Dyesire dyes. So, I'll start with them. And all, again, all of these are from Tuesday morning. Let me show you the other side where you can see how big they are. So all of these are from Tuesday morning. This butterfly one. This is a pretty big butterfly. Like, that's huge. This tree. I wanted this tree. I don't know why, but I really wanted this tree. I love it. I thought this tree was great because I can do a um, family tree project with my grandchildren. And it's big enough for them to do, put it on some um, crafts paper. It's pretty. This is the background, butterfly background. I love that. I was obsessed with getting that. I had to get it. This is a flower dye. Y'all know I have. All of the um, dyes from um, David Tutera that they were selling at um, Michael's. I have all of those. So this was kind of cute to see this, that they actually had one similar. But um, actually much cheaper than David Tutera's. But the thing about it is Desire dyes, I'm hoping that they cut much better than they used to. Because I was content with not buying their dyes. And then I seen everybody hauling them, and I didn't hear any bad, any more bad reviews about their dyes not cutting well. So that's right there. I have two of the same dye. So that's it for Desire. Okay. And here we are with Sheena. Leave a comment down below if you've seen these dyes before besides Tuesday morning. I've never heard of these dyes until I've seen them in Tuesday morning. But these are like that one by Desire that actually have the petals that you cut out and put together, piece together for to make a flower. Ah, that's gorgeous. That's just gorgeous. And then here's another one. Ah, I'm obsessed with this one. I freaking love this one. And especially if you make it dimensional. Oh my goodness. I'm just, a, I love this one. I can't wait to play with this. Then here's this one. And these are all flowers. These are all flower dyes. I'm sorry for covering up the code and you need to find the code. But you have to check these out. Like these are so gorgeous. 
I'm gonna use it. This one is a corner one. See that? Let me come back. So. Sorry for that glare going on. Let me hold this up one more time just in case that glare and you couldn't see. apologize again for that glare okay that's it for that and I'm winding down to the last of my Tuesday morning haul okay I got a couple of embossing folders that one and that one can't really see it but the front is better okay thought this was cute Definitely. And this one came with two embossing folders, two background design embossing folders, which are great. Okay. I have this stamp set by Diane. Yeah, this is Ranger. Diane Wakely. I mean, Dinah Wakely. This is her mixed media stamp set this was so cute and i didn't get to use it for christmas for christmas cards and stuff i had so much christmas stuff um that i ended up not using this stamp set but i may go back send out some holiday cards to people i know who celebrate the holiday and i didn't get to send them out their cards i still have family members that i didn't send even uh, a card to for the holiday and then these are my bow bunny I wanted this. Like, this is so cute. I actually did buy this a while back. This is the recipe one. I have the recipe one and I have the postcard one, which I love. And this was something new that came into Tuesday morning. This is so cute. And I have this stamp and uh, it's a bubble, word bubble set. And then I got this art impression one. Which was really cheap because these run you about fifteen dollars, sixteen dollars, at the Stampin' Scrapbook Expo and at um, Joann's or Michaels. So it's just super cute. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. I appreciate your support, your continued support. And again, I apologize. I'm so behind on my videos, so you will see these videos coming, and a lot of them will be random and out of sequence. But I wanted to share with you um, as you go on this crafting and uh, planner journey with me. So I thank you so much for watching. If you like what you see, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Just click the thumbs up button so that you like it and I can deliver you so much more content. If you have any comments or suggestions or if you have any questions, please leave a comment down below um, and be sure to click the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I love to subscribe back. All right. Have a great day. Um, happy crafting.